to Kindred Spirit Readings. This is for Sun, Moon and Rising. Let's begin Taurus. A little bit tricky this week. You could find yourself in a love triangle. You're confused about which direction you would like to take. You would like to head down. There are some misunderstandings when it comes to love and when it comes to your friendships. They, everything seems or appears to be completely the opposite, believe it or not. It's as though I see you heading down two different paths. You've got a great group of friends. You are surrounded by people that, especially in your friendship circle, who love you to the moon and back, you know, and, and they have no problem expressing this love towards you. It's quite lovely, in fact. It's so tight-knit, this friendship circle, that it's unbreakable, right? So you've got that. That is solid regardless. But then when it comes to your love life, I'm not seeing any progress. I'm not seeing that there's any movement. There's almost, and I want to say that it's as if you're showing... A different side of yourself or you're shying away or one of you or even both of you could be showing uh, shying away from any new ideas and moving on to the next phase of your lives together although apart so your next part of the next part of your relationship this this could be become really tricky if you're finding it really hard to communicate to talk to your partner about where you want to be or where it is you see yourself I mean, communication is key. This is the only way to be able to express or to be able to find out, depending on which end of the spectrum you find yourself sitting at. And this could be things proving uh, to be really difficult for not just one of you, but the two of you. And if you're not clear about your intentions, then you could see yourself being challenged and challenging others in the process. And this is not what anybody wants to have to go through because it, it becomes difficult and then could lead to breakups and there was no closure. It's good to have closure. You know, it, it's good to know where you stand at the end of the day. It brings peace within. It's not, there, there is nothing worse than not knowing. And you could find yourself stuck in a rut, but to be able to identify with yourself, to be able to identify with others and make messages, you know, clear as day, you can make yourself be heard and say, this is where I stand at the moment. This is where I see myself. Do you see yourself in the same place as where I see myself? For example, you know being precise, uh, it, it's, it, it allows for the message to be heard, to be clear about your intentions. Make new plans this week. If you are unsure about your next move regarding work, sit down, take time, note it all down. Make sure that you've got all your ducks in a row and that you know where you're headed because there is going to be a little bit of confusion around the way of money. I'm seeing that there could be the potential for more of it, uh, a pay rise, but there is competition standing in the way. And there is, as I mentioned before, moving offices, moving buildings. There's something in the way of different locations, uh, something to do with that type of movement. You may not like it at first, but this has become quite apparent and common. I will say common as well with within the last few years even. And just to be sure that you get through this is to stay really calm. There are a lot of people that are gonna be testing you. You're actually on edge at the best of times. I'm seeing that you've got some involvement with Aquarius and Scorpio this week. So this is going to bring many issues to the forefront. Thank you, Taurus.